Hi, this is Michael, KB9VBR. Today we're in the shack talking about slow scan television. So stay tuned. So what's the big deal about slow scan TV? Well, hams have been doing slow scan since the 1950s at the very least, uh, swapping images on the HF bands. But did you know that there's a slow scan transmitter on the International Space Station. That's right, uh, you, can re, uh, you can periodically receive slow scan images from the ISS as it orbits above the Earth. What do you need to um, start out with slow scan uh, to receive those ISS images? Well, the requirements are actually pretty light. All you need is a simple 2 meter FM mobile radio. You'll tune to the frequency of 145.800 megahertz. You'll need an antenna. It doesn't have to be a very high gain antenna. I'm using the two meter Slim Jim antenna. The two meter J-Pole antenna works well too, or even a quarter wave antenna. Lower gain antennas actually work better to receive those slow scan images as they cover both the horizon and the sky equally well. You do not really want a high gain antenna for this type of activity. And then finally, you're gonna need a computer application that's gonna decode those slow scan images and turn that into a, into a picture. I'm using the MMSSTV application. It's an open source application that works very well uh, for, for slow scan imagery for both on the HF bands and uh, for FM slow scan that we'll be receiving from the ISS. Finally, you're gonna need some type of traffic tracking program. You need to know when the ISS is gonna be overhead. One website you can go to is called heavensabove.com and that will tell you uh, when and where the ISS will be with its past predictors. Uh, there's some, on, there's some uh, real time applications like isstracker.com so you can see uh, the track paths as the station uh, moves overhead. I like to see ISS tracker because I can kind of correlate where the position of the ISS is with the received images that I'm picking up with the MMSS TV. And then really to bring everything together, just a simple audio cable plugged into the speaker jack of your transceiver into the line input of your computer and you're ready to start uh, receiving those slow scan images. So let's see, um, we're coming close to a pass. Let's see what one of them's gonna look like. All right, I can hear the, I can hear the, um, the sounds of the slow scan starting to come through. I'm gonna hold my microphone up closer to the speaker. Okay, now we finally have a signal lock. Uh, we can see the, um, on, the, on, the, on the tone meter there, and an image is starting to come through. We're probably going to get about half an image. Um, there's a lot of static on the signal. If you look, North Central Wisconsin here, and that's, this, the space station is quite a ways away from us, although it is moving closer. Good strong signal, no full quieting signal. If you look at the transceiver, um, we're, we're 40 over 9 here, so it's, it's full quieting right now. Excellent signal as the space station is moving closer to um, our location. The space station's at the horizon, it can be as far away as um, 1,500 miles, and then as it gets closer to overhead, uh, as little as 250 miles. It orbits about 250 miles above the Earth. the end of the transmission. Uh, unfortunately we only picked up about half an image there. 
We're back to static again. We've got to wait another three minutes before the slow scan uh, transmitter cycles again for another another image. I don't know in this pass if we're going to catch that or not. Um, if we do, we're going to be way on the fringes and we're going to look at a All right. Well, the satellite is a little bit overhead for us. We're in Wisconsin here. Um, so we're on uh, definitely on the backside pass of this, but it looks like we're getting a full quieting signal. A little bit of, oh, a little bit of static there. Slow scan's kind of fighting it. Will it come in? Will it come through? I hope you found this tutorial interesting and informative. And I'll go out there, uh, turn on your radios, and see if you can pick up some of those slow scan images from the International Space Station. Uh, you never know when a slow scan weekend will be coming up. So um, listen to the skies and um, watch the airwaves. This is Michael, KB9VBR, wishing you a great day and 73.